can I speak English? Because my French is lousy. All right, okay. it's, uh, uh, So, <coughs> the, <coughs> the group of drawings is the first time they all brought together. Uh -huh. Because they're coming from different collections, private collections and museums. And this one, there are two red rooms. In one of the red rooms, there's this tent. And the tent is made in the shape of two noses. And in this tent I, was my first laboratory, where I made first... Uh, I was fascinated by the idea of the metamorphosing, of the transformation. And in this tent, I... Uh, Dicked worms from the garden and catch flies and mosquitoes, cut the wings off, placed on the worms. I was a kind of young Dr. Frankenstein, in a sense. A kind of, I always was interested in a kind of La Gaia Scienza. La Gaia Scienza. La Gaia Scienza, the pleasant What's science. It it's an Italian expression. Right. It means a pleasant science. I was always uh, fascinated and inspired by scientists. Votre grand, euh, grand arrière-grand-père euh, était naturellement euh, Jean-Henri Fabre. C'est un entomologiste. Un entomologiste. Je suis passé par la famille, beaucoup de premiers sprints, manuscrits, collectionnels des insectes. Donc, ça m'a inspiré beaucoup comme jeune artiste. Comment s'est passé le passage du big bleu aux insectes Le premier était les insectes, les drawings. Et à ce moment, je n'avais pas assez d'argent. And I was starting to use the big pal pen because it was cheap. I could have it everywhere. So uh, because it was such a, a special color, an industrial color. And with, for, with other works, you see it's more natural colors. The the, the scarabs from the scarabees are natural colors, um, and I like the chemical color also. Vous êtes un artiste, uh, on peut dire uh, polyvalent. Donc vous êtes surtout. Uh, performeur au départ, vous êtes un homme de théâtre aussi, vous avez fait pas mal de spectacles dans votre carrière. Comment situez-vous la partie artistique aujourd'hui Est-ce que c'est du domaine, c'est un domaine particulier, central ou annexe à votre carrière aujourd'hui I always choose the best medium for the idea that I have. And I'm also a kind of consilience artist. I think, I mean, I, I, I studied a lot of insects. I'm an amateur entomologist. The space of insects, the movement of insects. And this I used, let us say, also in my theater work. Uh, I used also movements from insects in, in my choreographies, uh, the mise en scène. The, the place of the mise en scène is also inspired on the, the definition of animals and insects. So it's always a research of consilience between the different mediums. Mm -hmm. uh, le philosophe uh, belge Daniel Salvator Schiffer a dernièrement fait un texte sur uh, votre uh, travail au niveau des jetés uh, de chats en l'air. Et il a dit euh, « L'art contemporain recèle parfois en lui cette part maudite que j'appelle la barbarie à visage artistique. » Qu'est-ce que vous pensez de cette... Je peux dire deux choses. Um, first of all, les chats n'étaient pas hurtés. Il y avait des professionnels, des uh -huh. spécialistes animaux, des vétérinaires. Donc les chats n'étaient pas hurtés. Et plus, je ne peux pas dire parce que... I... The police advised me to don't say anything anymore because for my physical safety. All right. Yeah. Au niveau de la situation politique en Flandre aujourd'hui, uh, yes, of êtes, course, uh, it's already three times it happened to me in, in, in Flanders. One time after the royal palace, my work in the royal palace with the scarabies, I was bashed for six months. They put shit on my front door. They were um, hitting me on the street because I made something for Belgium, for the Queen. And so, let us say, the extreme right movements, they called me a land traitor, a queen fucker, and they uh, also then, physically, they make my life unsafe, 10 years ago. Then the second time, with an exhibition with Janut, with the, the meat pillars, uh, I had also, for months, that I could not sleep at home, and I had to move around. 
And of course, the situation in Flanders is everybody in Flanders knows that I'm anti Vlaams Blok, anti NVR. I have no sympathy for the winter, no sympathy for Bata Wever, their ideology. So I think it's also coming from that corner, of course, that they. Um, Uh, these kind of people do not like art. They do not, do not like beauty. Vous pensez euh, continuer à vivre en Belgique? Ça, ça vous fait peur cette montée de la uh, de la NVA? At this moment, I come from Paris. And I'm working in Paris. And a couple of days ago, I came from Athens. And I arrived back in Antwerp. And I was afraid physically. I was really afraid. I will not move. I'm born in Antwerp. I will stay in Antwerp. And I will fight. I think I will fight for beauty and defend beauty. But it's, it's not pleasant, I tell you. La beauté peut encore changer le monde aujourd'hui? I think I still believe in the strength and the force of beauty. Yes. Tout votre travail est axé sur cette métamorphose de, de la larve vers l'insecte. Votre travail, performance avec Abramovic, avec l'armure. Enfin, toute cette vision héroïque de l'artiste. Toute cette connotation, c'est une, une volonté de votre part de camoufler l'angoisse de la mort. L'angoisse, qu'est-ce que ça le, La peur, le, la peur de la mort. Non, 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 non. Je pense que mon travail est sur... Beaucoup de mon travail est sur vivre dans un kind of post-mortem stadium de vie. Because I was in my life two times in coma. And when you go from coma away, you're living in a kind of post-mortem stadium of life. So a lot of my work is, in a sense, a celebration of death. And for that reason, a celebration of life. Um, quel est votre sentiment sur la mort? La mort est un point final? No, no, I think for me, and you see this also in a lot of sculptures and drawings, for me, death is a cycle. Uh, for example, the scarabees in a lot of Vanitas paintings is a symbol from the bridge between life and death, but death not as a negative energy field, but as a positive energy field. That death is something, a movement in life. Prenez uh, l'image d'Alinienne comme un... No, as a, as a young artist, I was inspired by Dali because I think Dali was for me a very free artist. Uh, I mean, I think the show is one of the intelligent artists from the century. But Dali was quite free in the sense he was breaking down a lot of barriers because he did, he worked in Hollywood, he worked mm -hmm. with Walt Disney, he made publicity things, uh, he was a painter, a drawer, he, I mean, he was an artist to me who was quite free. So, and I was, as a young artist, I was inspired by him. Uh, but I think my work is not so surrealistic, I think my work is more, almost you could say, a kind of, Heritage of Belgium symbolism. I think so. When you take the artist and art away out of society, the society kills itself. You need artists and beauty in a society. Otherwise, you commit suicide. And I think for me, as an artist, I believe in the force of beauty, in the strength of beauty. All my work is uh, against cynicism. My work is full of hope. My work defends the vulnerability of the humankind, the vulnerability of the animal. Une prière pour Saint Rita, Yann. Uh,